Thank you, Chair. Uh, distinguished delegates, uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, directors, it's my honor to speak to you today uh, in this uh, format. Uh, on behalf of the Minister of Economy and Infrastructure of the Republic of Moldova, uh, we uh, present sincere compliments to General Secretariat for organizing this uh, important conference and to uh, United uh, Arab Emirates authorities for uh, great organization of the uh, event, support to great, uh, hosting this event in uh, this beautiful uh, city. So, this is a format where, at the global level, uh, the main trends and uh, the main uh, aspects of the development of the sector are discussed. Uh, after this uh, event, usually uh, this is replicated at regional level, this is replicated in, uh, in the countries, and I remember last sessions where we succeeded to successfully set up the goals of the organization, we succeeded to set up the necessary formats uh, for cooperation and uh, uh, our administrations, communication administrations succeeded to fulfill uh, their own uh, goals at national level, inclusively with the support of International Telecommunication Union with Secretary General support. So uh, one of the objectives we've set uh, many years, not so many years ago, uh, uh, five years ago, we we're just at the beginning of the uh, strategizing the next midterm uh, activities of the governmental authorities in uh, digital society development. We support inclusively the support of ITU, we succeeded to develop, develop uh, Digital Moldova 2020 strategy. So uh, we've addressed it as we considered few best practices. We considered the general line, strategic lines of the union. We've addressed it infrastructure, uh, chapter, we address it, content chapter, we address it, the capacities and education chapter, and the fourth horizontal one, security. And what we succeeded is that uh, actually at the midterm of the implementation of the strategy, we, we succeeded to uh, put Moldova on uh, again on technological uh, map of the world, so we are in the line of the countries with most affordable uh, best covering and uh, high speed uh, broadband connection across the country. So five years ago the topic was digital divide and now we can uh, state that about 90% of uh, households are connected or have direct access to landlines uh, broadband connections. Uh, more than 99 uh, percent of the country are covered in uh, 4G uh, uh, signal and uh, mobile uh, services, mobile data services. Uh, we are happy to, to state that internet penetration per usage is more than 76 percent. So this is actually uh, some of the figures which demonstrated that investing in infrastructure, liberalizing the markets can bring uh, society better services and can bring um, our communities uh, in in new digital era. Uh, what about the next chapter on content? Government is leading the process with the governance agenda and uh, more than 100 services, critical services became uh, available online uh, at the uh, necessary level of complexity actually using the created infrastructure in, uh, in, the, uh, in order to answer to the expectation of the society, not only for entertainment and communication, but also to give access to services, what is most wanted by, by our communities. Um, of course, education is one of the chapters we are working for, and finally we succeeded to readjust the uh, university uh, curricula in uh, in whole range from electronic communications to uh, uh, information technologies and university. We succeeded from this year to introduce digital education for first degree or the first day uh, of uh, uh, kids coming in school. They they have access to new technologies and they have access to new curricula, which uh, is gonna educate new users and new. Um, 
specialists in this uh, critical field. So we succeeded with support of ITU uh, at last two uh, last years. We succeeded to work on, on a report uh, uh, done by BDT uh, Innovation Service of ITU. And uh, this report, uh, very professional, uh, uh, conducted by, by IT expertise, uh, ICT-centric innovative ecosystem country review, actually was of the, one of the main documents which uh, was the basement for development of our next uh, strategy or action plan on uh, ICT innovation promotion horizontally. So it was adopted recently by the government and it touches very critical areas. One of them uh, is innovation, ICT innovation in, in critical industries. So from another side, we succeeded to, to bring to the market a new proposition, ambitious proposition of Moldovan government regarding the IT parks development, which is a unique model of uh, Taxation actually is a new system for taxation of IT companies which are working in uh, virtual uh, IT parks and uh, actually in nine months we succeeded to attract more than three, uh, at least uh, 300 of uh, companies, one set of which are new created companies and one set of which are companies, uh, foreign companies, which are developing their IT and C business in, in a virtual park and they taxation level was cut in a half. So they, this stimulated the industry and we registered at last in the last three, three years 50% uh, growth uh, from year to year uh, of the exports of IT and C services abroad. So it, we demonstrated, it demonstrated that a targeted policy implementation um, exchange of best cases, uh, support of international organization and participation of this uh, uh, organization which can provide high level expertise to, to, to countries actually demonstrated that we can together do great things and we expect that ITU as a UN agency will continue its effort and will apply in practice one of the corner principles of UN, one country, one voice, and we'll apply uh, targeted policies for every country because all of us are different and at the same, we are following the same goals. So wish all of us success for the next period with next objectives and uh, next, strateg next strategics, uh, uh, strategic lines. I wish all of us success. I wish Secretary General a success in promoting the goals of organization at region, regional level and to strengthen each uh, its uh, regional presence taking into account the necessities of every of our countries here. Thank you very much.